I'm Julia, and this is your daily dose of tech news on Netlink Daily. We've got Model X, OS X, GeForce Now, so much news. Let's do this. NVIDIA has rebranded their Grid Game Streaming service to GeForce Now. After extending the free beta for Grid like three or four times, the company is finally launching it on October 1st in North America, the European Union, and Japan. If you have an NVIDIA Shield device, eight bucks a month gets you access to a library of over 50 games to stream at up to 1080p and 60fps, if your internet connection supports it. Most games will have been out for at least six months, but you can also buy new games from the GeForce Now store when they come out, so you can play it immediately and then download it later. NVIDIA is also launching the Shield Android TV in Europe to coincide with the launch of GeForce Now tomorrow. And apparently, the first three months of the service are free. Really, NVIDIA? You're still not ready to start charging for this? I mean, hey. Free stuff is free stuff, though. Apple has launched OS X El Capitan, the next version of their desktop operating system. Mac computers running OS 10.6.8 or later can download the update from the App Store for free, as usual. Most of El Capitan's changes are under the hood, but there are some visible changes. The mission control interface has been given a design overhaul, Spotlight can now respond to contextual, naturally worded searches, and the OS now supports Split View, which is basically the snap feature from Windows, which has been there since Windows 7. Just saying. And Tesla has officially launched their Model X electric SUV. The vehicle features the same ludicrous speed feature found in the Model S. Iconic hinged to gullwing doors, a range of around 250 miles, and seating for up to seven people. Perhaps the most interesting feature, though, is the bioweapon defense mode. And not even joking about that. The air filter in the Model X is about 10 times larger than a normal car's, and is apparently 300 times better at filtering airborne bacteria and 800 times better at filtering viruses. At the launch, Elon Musk clarified that the extreme air filtering mode should come in handy if there's, you know, ever an apocalyptic scenario of some sort. Well, he should know, I guess. He's Iron Man. Snippity snap snoops, but I can't snap. I crushed my finger in the clapper. Semenium is a Sweden-based company that's looking for $1.25 million on Kickstarter to build a smartphone that can double as a PC. With a Snapdragon 820, 6GB of RAM, 256GB of storage, a 24-megapixel camera, and 4,000 milliamp hour battery. It would be awesome if it were true, but it might not be, so probably hold off on your donations. AMD has very quietly launched their sixth generation AMD Pro lineup of APUs intended for business notebooks, probably because there's not much of a difference between these and their predecessors. Instagram has a gaping hole where VR content should be, or at least shot thinks so. They're a startup on Kickstarter selling their dual wide angle lens iPhone attachment that can stitch photos and videos together in a 360 view. Windows accidentally listed their new Lumia phones briefly this morning before taking them down, confirming some pretty impressive specs. And Hitachi has apparently made a minority report machine capable of predicting crimes before they happen, or at least where they'll happen. Has this announcement been timed with the Minority Report TV series? Because if so, great job marketing. Great job. News sources for all of today's stories can be found in the forum post linked in the description. If I lack swagger at Zumba, that's fine with me. Wait, wait, I don't lack swagger, it's keys. Well, I... Mm. And it's fine with me. You should still go to Zumba with us, though. No. We can look like fools together. Oh. Yep, he's going to Zumba. Heroes of the Storm has been out for a while now, and I actually tried it back out when it was in beta, and it's quite fun. And also, if you play D3, it gives you the Diablo hero, so go do that. But if you're on the fence still about this game, this might push you right over it. Right now, if you buy a GeForce GTX 950 or 960 from NCIX, you'll get a Kaijo Diablo bundle for Heroes of the Storm. That includes the Diablo Hero, Kaijo skin, and a seven-day stim pack. If you want to find out, I recommend clicking here for more details or in the link in the description. All right, that's it for Netlink Daily, guys. Thanks for watching. Click over here for more videos and follow us on social media over here. Also, don't forget to like and subscribe for more videos like this from NCIX. Now, I'm off to New York. See you all in two weeks. Try not to miss me too much, eh? That was very Canadian. <laughs> Try not to miss me too much, eh? 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 Okay, bye.